Hello everyone! It's so nice to see all of you. So before we start, may I request you to please stand? Come on, stand. Raise your left hand. Put it in your right shoulder. Your right hand in your left shoulder. And then wiggle your hips. Again, wiggle your hips. So in the count of three, we will do it together. Are you ready? Okay. One, two, three. Get ready to wiggle. Another one. Wow, it seems that you're all good dancers. Did you enjoy that? Yes. Okay. So before we begin our lesson today in computer, I will show you a picture and you will tell me what is on the picture. Let's start. Number one, we have bicycle. Number two, car. Number three, train. And number four, airplane. That's correct. So these are vehicles according to their speed. Very good. Children, why do you think people invent these things? Do you have any idea? Hmm. Aha! Maybe they invent these things for us to travel around the world because we use this vehicle to travel around the world. And also, we can use them in some emergency situation, right? Yes. What other inventions do you think help people do things easier and faster? Well, that's right. We have cell phone, television, and computer. We have lots of inventions and people continue to invent things, right? A while ago, you mentioned about the computer, right? Did you know that before the modern computer was invented, there are early counting tools that our ancestors used? In today's lesson, you will identify the early computing devices used by our ancestors, draw the different computing devices creatively, and appreciate the importance of inventions to human lives. Are you ready? Yes. Here are the early computing devices. Number one, Abacus. Abacus is used by the Chinese people. It used beads and rods to count numbers. Again, what is this? Very good. This is Abacus. Number two is Pascalin or Pascal's calculator. It was invented by Blaise Pascal and it used wheel to move numbers. Again, what is this? Correct. Everybody say Pascal. That's right. Number three is Leibniz calculator. It was invented by Gottfried Wilhelm Leibniz and it is used to perform simple addition, multiplication, subtraction, and division. Again, what is this? Very good. It is Leibniz calculator. Okay. Number four is Jacquard loom. It was invented by Joseph Marie Jacquard and it is used to weave fabrics for holes and punch cards. Again, what is this? Great. This is Jacquard loom. Number five is analytical engine. It was invented by two people. Number one is Charles Babbage and number two is Lady Augusta Byron. Charles Babbage is called as the father of modern computer. Analytical engine was known as the first type of modern computer that can do multiple tasks. Again, what is this? Very good. This is the analytical engine. Number six is tabulating machine. It was invented by Herman Hollerith and it is used to count and record data faster by the U.S. government 
Intabulity Census. Census is a survey of population. Again, what is this? Very good. This is a tabulating machine. And lastly, the modern computer was invented. It is a device that you can use to process data easily. Did you learn something today? Yes! Yes? Wow! I'm so happy to hear that. So now let us review. What are the early computing devices? We have Abacus, Pascalin, Leibniz Calculator, Jacquard Loom, Analytical Engine, and Tabulating Machine. Very good. How do these things help us to do things easier and faster? We can count large numbers easier and faster. Bravo! Here are the activities that you need to answer. Goodbye! See you next time!